This morning, new revelations that the Department of Justice considered sending FBI agents to President Biden's Delaware home to monitor the search for classified documents. Sources familiar with the matter tell ABC News because the Biden team was fully cooperating with the government, the DOJ ultimately agreed to back off and let Biden's lawyers carry out their own searches in November. President Biden largely staying silent on the latest batch of classified documents found in his private home, including five the White House revealed were discovered last Thursday. The administration now under fire for not disclosing that information until the weekend. I have been forthcoming from this podium. And Ian Sam, spokesperson for the White House Counsel's Office, telling reporters, while we're limited in what we can say during an ongoing DOJ inquiry, we are providing as much information publicly as is appropriate. House Republicans now launching two separate congressional inquiries into the documents, accusing the administration of waiting months to tell the American people about their discovery. And this is why there's such hypocrisy behind the Bidens once again, something big that comes forward prior to an election where they kind of keep it quiet, where the American public could actually have a say in it. But the White House hitting back, blasting Republicans for what they call hypocrisy, noting that they had little interest in investigating the reams of classified documents seized by the FBI at former President Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago estate. Now, in addition to those congressional investigations, there's also a special counsel looking into these documents. The White House has said it will cooperate fully with the special counsel, but it's unclear what their level of cooperation will be with those Republican-led probes in the House. Jay O'Brien, ABC News, Washington.